Hello and welcome to Building and Breaking GMod, the show where I try to build it but probably end up breaking it. I'm your host, Carl101, and today we will be building a plant out of things you find in a bedroom or bathroom. So with that being said, let us begin. So what we're probably going to want to start off with is, if you can see, if you read what I uh, typed in there, we need a bed. That's not a bed. It's a gate. You're right. I guess you can call that a bed. So anyways, now that we have a bed, let's uh, take a look at what else we can do. Uh, something with a bathtub. Not stuck in. There we go. Don't run away. Another bathtub going here. Uh... Nice bathtub too. Okay, so let's see here. Um, let's go ahead and weld this two together like so. Yeah, like that. Okay. Now let's go ahead and this can be the uh, wings, I guess. Do the same thing over here. Okay, so uh, that's a pretty good design already. You can see that flying around, can't you? Wee! All right, so now for the ultimate challenge: can it actually fly? Well, let's find out. So let's go ahead and attach some thrusters. Uh, today we're going to be using rings and ring flutter for our uh, sound and stuff. We're going to go ahead and put a thousand for thrusters on the back. Like so. This, should, this will make it go forward when it's actually up in the air. And on the bottom, we're going to do the same thing. Put a thruster there. Uh, actually, let's put two thrusters there. See how that works. Put a thruster there. You know what? Let's try that again. Let's put one thruster there, one thruster in the middle, one thruster in the back. Then we'll do side thrusters. Yes, I want that. And we switch these around. Let's see how that looks. It is like extremely heavy, so let's go ahead and uh, lighten it up. Wow. No wonder. Let's give it. Let's make that 300. I don't know why those are so heavy. Let's go ahead and do the same thing for that. Okay, let's make it all 100. So it weighs 100 Gmod units, I guess you could call them. Okay, it almost lifts off. We just need to, uh... kind of works, I guess. No, it does not kind of work. Okay, still needs a few more, um... Let's go ahead and put four thrusters in the back here. Okay, now it has too many thrusters in the back. Oops. What did I get rid of? Okay. Go ahead and remove that. Uh, remove, remove. There's the remover. Now let's add thrusters again. We'll add three. See how that does. This is not working. I 
Actually, let's add some forward thrusters. Side tier. It either wants to be too heavy in the front or the back. It never wants to make up its mind. So we're gonna reduce this, reduce, reduce this to a third of what it is, or actually a fourth. Put another thruster in the front. See if we can level this out. Still not working. Needs a little more uh, thruster power in the front. So let's uh, make it one four out of tenth in the front. I guess you could call it. All right, uh, that actually might work. So let's go ahead and put a chair on it. See how that works. Looks. Of course, we could have problems with the chair actually, you know, staying on the plane. Then we can also have problems trying to stand the freaking chair up. There we go. This is totally not working. This is totally working. My dogs are barking. There's never a day without dogs barking, you know? It just never ends. The mailman just gotta show up and everything. But anyways, as far as the plane's looking, uh oh, there we go. Hey, I almost died. Um, you know I would highly not. Yeah, no. This is a dud. This totally is a dud. So, with that being said, let's kill ourselves. Yes. No. Let's break it. Stupid plane. Chose not to work. You get the ultimate punishment. The ultimate punishment. Okay. That's what I say. I'm Carl101, and that has been Building and Breaking Gmod. See you next time.